all have a venue in life. We all have our own personal venue, and we have choices as to where we sit in this venue of life. My name is Marilyn Sherman. I'm a motivational keynote speaker. What I bring to an organization are tools and strategies to help them be more engaged, to be more motivated, to have the right mindset, and I increase the chances of their success. We have three choices in this particular venue. Balcony, general admission, or the front row. Balcony seats are where you are so disengaged and easily distracted that you could leave that balcony seat and come back and no one would have noticed that you had left. General admission is where you are in a comfort zone. It's not bad, but it's not great. And then there's the front row where you get to say, it doesn't get any better than this. I don't want you to limit yourself to only things that have been realistic for you in the past. I want you to think bigger than that. From Coke to Pepsi, McDonald's to the United States Postal Service to High Point University. I mean, a lot of different brands and they all hire me for the same thing because I give them the strategies and the tools to work in a more positive environment, um, set their goals, they work with more purpose, they work with more intention, and people walk out with inspiration and hope knowing that they can do their jobs better after hearing me speak. We've just completed uh, one of our general sessions where Marilyn Sherman spoke, uh, and it was fabulous. I had spent some time with her on the phone prior prepping for this, and I had a high expectations, and quite frankly, she exceeded them. Uh, the session was engaging, energetic, she's certainly knowledgeable on the topics, and a lot of our participants uh, were really very happy with the result we got, and walking out motivated and happy and ready to go back to their workforce and build their businesses. She's famous as the author of four books, and she's infamous as the volunteer in her community. The ultimate seat in life is to be an usher. And what that means is you are illuminating the path because you're a leader, you've been there before, you have more knowledge, experience, and awareness than the, than the people that you are leading. So when you are living your best life, your purpose as a leader is to illuminate that path for others to get to their front row. Hey, had a great time here with Marilyn. Uh, she taught us how to get out of our comfort zone. And then I show this picture to my dad, and my dad is such a guy's guy, such a macho guy. I said, Dad, who is mom bringing home from the hospital in this picture? And he looked at this picture, and his reaction was very different than I anticipated. He looked at that picture and he said, I remember that car. <laughs> <laughs> they walk out feeling not only equipped with tools to help them lead better, and manage better and live their life better, but they also walk away smiling because they had a good time while watching me speak. I was sharing a car with someone who said, what, what brings you to, to Orlando? I said, well, I'm going to speak at this really big women's conference. And he looked at me and he put this big smile on his face and he's like, I love big women. <laughs> I love large babies. <laughs> Laughing hysterically releases endorphins in the brain, and you can get these endorphins released anytime you either laugh hysterically, work out, eat chocolate, or have sex. Not all at the same time. My wife and I have a business, and we're kind of beat up. My wife is really beat up, and this was so much for her. And so the takeaways from this are just amazing that we're going to be able to go back and apply to be lifted up. So thank you, Marilyn. I tell stories that speak to the heart and to the mind of each individual in that room. They walk away like, wow, you were really talking to me. Marilyn is one of the best. Really impactful. Best of the best. I loved it. Made me teary-eyed. I don't think there was a dry eye in the house. When you change your seat, you change your life. But even better, when you change your seat, you get a chance to change someone else's life. My guests are a bunch of hedge fund managers, which are very hard people to motivate. But she did a phenomenal job, and I got awesome feedback. Thank you, Marilyn, for doing such a wonderful job at the Global Fund Forum. So what did you think of Marilyn Sherman's lecture? Oh, she's awesome. I saw her last year, I loved her. I saw her this year, I loved her. When people walk out of my keynote, they are re-engaged, re-motivated, re-energized towards their vision and their purpose. They are on fire, and I love to see that energy when they leave the room. It's as if they can't wait to get back to work. Marilyn Sherman, she knocked it out of the park. You don't have to settle for that balcony seat anymore. You don't have to settle. You deserve a front row seat in life. 
and I want to be the usher to help you get there. 